Hi, my name is Dr. Deepa Garg. I'm an ophthalmologist practicing in Mumbai for the past 15 years. And today I'm going to explain to you the difference between single vision lenses and progressive lenses. All of our eyes are like an autofocus camera. So we can see far, we can see near, we can see any distance in between very clearly whenever we want. But when we turn 40, we start experiencing difficulty for seeing near things. And that happens because the lens inside our eye, which is normally used to autofocusing, loses that ability. And this loss of ability continues for the next 10 to 15 years. Single vision glasses give you one point of focus. So if you have a distance number, they will help you see for far clearly. After 40, if you wear single vision glasses, what would happen is that you will be able to see for far, but you may have a challenge looking at your phone, you may have a challenge reading your book. And therefore what you will need is to get another pair of glasses, which has a number for reading. So every time you want to read, you'll have to take off your distance glasses and wear your reading glasses and then read. And when you finish reading, if you look up wearing your reading glasses, you will not be able to see anything for far. So you have to again take off your reading glasses and wear your distance glasses. This juggling between two pairs of glasses is something that progressive lenses can avoid. 30 years ago or 20 years ago, bifocals were very popular. Bifocals meaning, you know, you have two lenses with a line in the middle. And what these lenses do is the top part of the lens will help you see for far. The bottom part of the lens will help you see for near. But 20 years ago, we did not have computers as much as we use them today. Now computers are being used at a distance which is a little further away than what we would call a reading distance and obviously much closer than a television and that distance we call as intermediate distance. So if you have two pairs of glasses, one for far, one for reading and you don't mind juggling with these two pairs of glasses, you still will not be comfortable with your computer vision. What you would have to do is wear your reading glasses but then you would have to go closer to a computer to see the computer clearly. So I believe that for people of our generation, for people between 40 to 65, 70, progressive lenses is the way to go because it's just not practical to maintain two pairs of glasses or three pairs of glasses to actually carry on our daily activities. The problem with progressive lenses are that when we start wearing progressive lenses for the first time, they would take you 10 days to get used to. You have to figure out at which part of the lens to look through to see what distance clearly. And sometimes this getting used to period, which may last from let's say seven to 10 days, can put people off progressive lenses. So whenever we prescribe progressive lenses, we actually set these expectations so that people don't really throw away their glasses in two days saying that they didn't like them. And of course, the other thing with progressive lenses are that they are much more expensive than a single vision glasses. But considering the benefit for us today, I personally believe progressive lenses are the way to go. LensCart offers a wide range of prescription lenses created by robotic precision technology that ensures 100% error-free glasses. Please download the LensCart app or visit any of our 700 plus stores for all your eyeglass needs.